Hello everyone, now that we've gotten used to playing around with the uh, incremental movements in snap mode, we're going to also play around with the additionals or settings that snap mode provides us with. Now again, I'm just going to turn on snap mode, this icon here, the magnet icon, and uh, we're going to click on this sort of icon right beside the magnet icon. As you can see, if we click into it, you'll see these other additional settings, the snap elements, as it's called, the volume, face, edge, and vertex. Now, right now, our object is moving, say, in an incremental sort of uh, way. Uh, if we were to turn it to, say, vertex, it's going to just you know, snap to the vertexes of this cube. Now, uh, since we have one cube here, I'm going to duplicate it, so I can demonstrate what it looks like. I move this, click Shift D to duplicate it, move it on the Y axis, use, click on Y, let's move it down, say here. Now, uh, gonna kind of describe what uh, vertex, face, and edges are. Uh, if I were to click on something, say the edit mode, I'm gonna click into edit mode, click tab. Uh, this right now uh, lets us go into this option where we can select individual sort of uh, points right here. Now a vertex is the singular point of our, say, our object right here. Now uh, these points sort of uh, shape up to make this cube. If we were to click on Control Tab, we can go into something called the Mesh Selection Mode. Uh, with that, we can select either edge, face, or vertex. Since we're currently on vertex, we can go to edge and play around with selecting the individual edges of our cube and or go to the face mode, uh, control tab, select face, and click each individual face around our cube. Now, with that done, uh, let's go ahead and sort of move our object. Let's go back into object mode and simply click on tab. And since we're going to, let's say, test out vertex, we can snap this, say, onto these vertex points right here, as you can see. If you just select that, it will automatically snap to this object's uh, vertex. If I were to, say, move on an X, uh, X axis right now, you can click on these, move it down, let's maybe move it again, snap it there, and there. It snaps right to the vertex. It's basically the same for the edges and faces. Uh, say, look uh, at the edge, you can just snap it to that edge right there, and it'll snap our cube onto the other sort of object here. And yeah, that's pretty much it with the additional sort of settings of snap mode. Uh, if there are any issues, you can sort of just play around with it, get used to it, and it will come in handy in the future if you are, you know, uh, wanting to snap an object to another object and sort of uh, combining them together. Yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.